The Santa Barbara Mission and its historic ruins are getting a level of fire protection they've never seen before. News Channel reporter John Palmentary shows us the flock that's hard at work. Loving God, we thank you that you have given us and provided us with these sheep. In the historic ruins near the Santa Barbara Old Mission, Father Larry Goslin visits a flock of sheep that have just arrived. Both for protection of this land, to reduce the fuel and the vegetation that might be growing here, so as to protect our community from any future fires. The Santa Barbara City Parks Department has a busy schedule at five parks, including the Mission Historical Park, for about 100 sheep to eat dry grass that could be a fire danger. Some of the structures here date back to the 1800s. We're trying to at least reduce the fuels so they're on the ground. The sheep can go through more than a half an acre a day. The traditional way we did this before was with a, a large tractor and a field mower and we'd go through and mow everything to the ground, have staff that would use weed whips where the tractor couldn't fit um, and basically mechanically manage this. With all the rain we've had this year, some of the grasses have grown to about this high, so you can see how much work the sheep have done already to bring that level down. The site is adjacent to the Rose Garden Park where the public can see the sheep up close. You know, on one side we have the beautiful Rose Garden and the Mission and large grass area, and over here we have our more passive open space area protecting the, the ruins in their, in their natural state. This is a historic um, site, so we want to protect the the ruins are here from the early mission days. We're really happy the sheep seem to be pretty gentle on the ground. At one time, maybe there were sheep here. <laughs> I, would, I would guess that there, there's a good chance there were. I know there were sheep and cattle that were part of the mission. A fire here could threaten the mission, the Riviera and the Upper East Side, and the grasses have already dried out. With the sheep at work, those who live and visit the mission now have an even further sense of safety. They are, they're protecting it. They're protecting it from fire. Isn't this a wonderful gift? In Santa Barbara, I'm News Channel reporter John Palmentary. The Santa Maria Bonita School District will